Tracking showers exiting very early for our Sunday. That's going to be out at least by the mid-morning, just before 8 a.m. So uh, for the rest of our Sunday, don't expect any of those showers. Maybe just some slick roads to start out very early in the morning. Uh, really the biggest impact behind that's going to be these winds throughout the day. You can see very early today, uh, already seeing those wind speeds up to around 15 miles per hour at max, but uh, could reach closer to even 20 or more miles per hour throughout the afternoon. Still, uh, we notice those are coming out of the north behind that cold front. Right, that's going to keep our temperatures well below average this time of year. A good 20 degrees cooler for some of us uh, compared to yesterday as we only top out even in those upper 60s for maybe the cloudiest areas, but still plenty of sunshine to enjoy uh, in between just some partly cloudy skies today. And we'll see those temperatures uh, easily sinking back to those 60s. Again, we're not really going to get far into those 70s today, so it's a good idea maybe to have an extra layer on hand if you have those late evening plans as we'll already be back close to those 50s just after sundown. And then even uh, maybe 10 degrees cooler by uh, early tomorrow morning here. That's where you'll definitely maybe need that lighter jacket as some of us could even make our way to those upper 40s, the coolest we've been uh, for quite some time. So again, good idea to maybe grab some of those extra layers. But by the afternoon for Monday, kind of reversing that again to get uh, a little bit of a warming trend into mid-Missouri as we'll just see those drier skies just steadily ticking those highs up day by day. For Monday, you see us uh, on that other end of the 70s, closer to the 80 mark, and that is just going to continue, unfortunately, into the rest of the work week. We had some low pressure that uh, brought this round of rain over the weekend. This deep low pressure actually expected to get cut off from the stream here at least into Monday. We'll have to see if that lingers nearby to keep cloud cover into the area, but uh, no rain chances certainly out of that system. We've got that northerly flow keeping us very dry here. We will see that change, though, uh, this ridge of high pressure heading our way out of the west by the middle parts of the week. This is what's keeping us dry here and will lead to that slight warm up at least by the second half of the week, possibly seeing that flatten out a bit and closer to next weekend. That's where we could get some of these disturbances heading our way where we see these uh, kind of wavy pattern to that jet stream where that may break down that ridge just a bit to bring some more chances for rain, but it is really looking very slim at this point. At least this Sunday, probably the highest rain chances we'll face for all of the rest of the week. Otherwise, still fantastic to head outdoors as we get a little bit of a taste of fall here to start the work week in those 70s and then just warm um, right back to what we've seen the past couple of weeks in those upper 80s.